Hi hey everybody, it's Jessica from Tensita Johnson and we are back with a new tutorial. This time another one on my own hair for a five strand braid and I used a big bow as it's right now the festive time. I started with wettening a bit my hair and then sectioning off a bit from the front. It's like a square shape and now I'm doing three strands out of this portion and I bring the left part over the middle, the right part over the middle. In addition to those three strands, I grab now from the left hand side where I started, the fourth strand, and I'm bringing it under the neighbor strand and over the one by the side. Now it's important always to put your fingers in between of the gaps. Now grab the fifth strand, bring it under its neighbor to the left hand side. and then over the strand that is next to it. Now you have five strands and in between these strands you put your fingers and you hold the first strand, you see? Now bring under the left hand strand, hold between thumb and index finger, add in a tiny portion of hair, together you bring this over the neighbor strand. Again, put your fingers in between of the gaps. Now do exactly the same thing on the right hand side, bring the right strand under, add in some hair and then go over its neighbor. So the braiding pattern that you're always going to do is under, over and then from the other side under, over. Remember when you brought under the strand from the outer side to add in some hair. Now I show you from behind. Start with bringing under the strand. To the same two fingers where you're holding the strand, you add in the hair, smooth it all with out. And then bring this one over the neighbor. And now in between of all these gaps, you are nicely separating those five strands. Okay. Muchas de vosotras me habéis pedido que explico paso a paso en castellano. No es mi idioma materna igual que el inglés, so voy a intentarlo y a ver si me podéis seguir. Uh, cuando llegamos otra vez a la derecha, voy a intentar explicarlo. Empezamos con el mechón de la derecha y lo llevamos debajo. Añadimos pelo y lo aguantamos entre los mismos dos dedos. Y ahora esto va encima del strand de al lado y lo más importante, con los dedos siempre vais entre los mechones. Así siempre están bien, bien, bien separados por vuestros dedos. Y así sigues hasta el fin, cuando no hay más pelo de añadir. Ok, keep on braiding always the same pattern until you have no more hair to add in. When you reach the end, just do two more stitches and then you tie it up with a hair elastic. Al final, usáis un coletero para juntar la coleta. Ahora usáis laca, use some hairspray against the flyaways in the front and over the braid. Y esta laca es contra los flyaways, los baby hairs, la pelusa que tenemos, ten, tengo yo delante y lo pongo también encima de la trenza antes de hacerla más grande y más voluminoso. And now I'm pulling the outer edges to make the braid wider, bigger and having more volume. you like the final result and this is the five strand braid DIY tutorial on myself. Espero que os gusta el toque final que le doy ahora. 
because it was Christmas, I used the hair bow that I found in Trentita stuff to give it a festive touch. Un toque festivo para esta trenza es fácil de hacer que no me tardaba ni más que 10 minutos. If you like this tutorial, please give us a thumbs up, comment what you would like to see next as DIY tutorial and subscribe to our channel if you haven't yet. Espero que os ha gustado mucho nuestro tutorial, darnos un pulgar arriba y espero veros pronto aquí otra vez. Cada martes y viernes subimos videos. Adiós.